I'm Tim Wendelbaum and in 2008 started uh, what's now called the World Aeropress Championship in uh, our little cupping lab in our store. Basically just to figure out how to use the Aeropress. So let me show you how we brew the Aeropress in our bar, which is a very standard recipe. We use 14 grams of coffee. We rinse the paper filter in the Aeropress with hot water, so... Just a little bit of hot water to rinse the filter. Pour that out. And the only thing we adjust is the grind setting. So we always use 14 grams of coffee, 200 grams of brew water. And then if it's too thin or weak, we'll grind finer. If it's too bitter, we'll grind coarser. So this coffee is going to be ground on 12. Ready to brew straight into the AeroPress. And then we set the timer to one minute. Two hundred and one grams. That's okay. We have a little bit of tolerance. I stir three times just to mix the coffee, so that all the coffee gets wet. And then we're going to leave it for one minute. That's why we use the timer. And after one minute, I'm going to stir again, only three times, back to front. Because if we stir more or less, we will change the extraction. So if we use stir five times, it'll be over extracted. If you stir one time, it'll be under extracted. So it's important that we do it exactly the same time, same amount of times every time. Um, and the reason why we add this stir is because we're only brewing for a minute. So we need to brew quickly. Uh, and then the stirring helps for the extraction. Was it temperature water? Temperature of the water from the Uber boiler is 96 degrees, so that means it's around 92 degrees during the brewing. So, AeroPress stirrer, one, two, three. That's it. And then you put the plunger on and just lean on it. Should be easy to press, not too hard, not too easy either. Normally it takes around 30 seconds. If you press too hard, you're just going to squirt a lot of coffee everywhere. And we press all the way through. Because so you don't really over extract the coffee by doing that. It just makes the cleaning a lot easier. When you're done, take the filter holder off, squeeze out the puck and you rinse. And that's it. Then we need to serve it.